Hey everybody, welcome to the turn four video for the Battle of Lhasa. If you haven't watched the introduction video, please go back and watch that uh, as it will describe all the rules and the players and so on and so forth. It'd be good to watch the videos before this one so you kind of have an idea what's going on. Okay, let's just jump into the sectors now. In Green Sector, TN continued his campaign of eroding the enemy defenses. He attacked a two-skull fixed unit on the, on the coastline and destroyed it. He then retreated back to G3, keeping himself out of the reach of the three-skull mobile unit in H10. In Blue Sector, we had a very heavy counterattack go on. All four units were engaged in a combat this time. The battalion supply took out the 1.5 skull mobile convoy unit, while the other three units, KK, RW, and FT, attacked the 10 skull mobile mech unit, taking out seven skulls of it, and forcing the remaining three skulls to retreat. Orange Sector was fairly quiet this turn. They managed to finish off the docks. T4 moved forward from the storage area to do that while the other units repositioned themselves around to take on the 24 skull mobile mech unit that was looming in hex C10. This was the point that the players found out that the dropships that they had arrived in had been destroyed by the Capellans. The pirate jumpships that were hired to bring them here had fled, leaving those dropships behind. Three aerospace fighters managed to return from the battle, landing at the airport, providing the players with some fighter support. These aerospace fighters can be used to knock half a skull off of any battle rating the players are engaged in. The aerospace fighters can only perform one mission per turn, and they must be stored at the airport. At the end of the turn, Liao got to move, and that's when the players realized that they were in a bad situation. Nine Union class dropships dropped in the planet. In Green Sector, two dropships landed, dropping 12 skulls of mobile units. Orange Sector had it the worst. Four Union dropships landed each of them dropping six skulls of mobile mech units. Two dropped in the east, two dropped in the west. The 24 skull mobile unit and the three skull fixed mobile unit in the north of Orange Sector continued their move to the east, staying out of the player's reach. At this point, it looks like the players have gotten themselves surrounded. In Blue Sector, three Union dropships landed along the coastline. One of the dropships landed in range of KK and RW, which means they might have a potential to be able to capture that dropship. And that completes the battle report for turn 4 for the Battle of Lhasa. As always, the links are in the description below for any battles that were recorded. Please go check them out. And until next time, we'll see you later.